I'm Barrett Phillips with Small HD, and this is our new 502 field monitor. Uh, this is also comes as a combination kit that's called the Sidefinder. It has a viewfinder attachment that sits right onto the front, uh, and that in total is $1,500, and just the monitor itself is $300 less than that. Uh, and the monitor is available now. It is a 1080p display, uh, it's full HD, and uh, the user experience is really the main thing that we've been trying to tackle. Uh, and sort of how that's translated is into this sort of page style system. So you have these pages that you can thumb through, and each one of these pages are fully customizable with whatever feature set you want to use. So for example, I could create one page that, like, like this one that's an exposure assist page, and I can flip over back to a normal page that just has, for, for example, in this case, just a lookup table. And I can load other lookup tables through the SD card and to the top, take them out of any kind of color grading software, pop them right on the monitor, and easily just create new pages and add looks to those. I'll show you adding a new feature. Now I'm just browsing the SD card. So now I just applied a new lookup table to the footage. So there you go. So this is a Sidefinder EVF. Uh, this one currently has our pro mounting bracket attached to it, which comes with the Sidefinder. Um, that allows you to use NATO rails. Uh, it's got quarter 20s on the top and bottom. It'll also allow rod mounting, pretty much any kind of mounting configuration you would want for a viewfinder. Uh, and it also just flips open just like this, uh, and you're able to see the screen uh, just as easily, as, you know, just as setting a camera top monitor. Um, and uh, when it closes back, it will actually, uh, it, it down reses to a 1366 by 768 view, uh, and that's to keep the form factor small, but it also gives you the benefit of having these windows on the side that allow scopes. Um, it scopes as well as other meters, uh, like audio meters, and you can see it's got HDMI or input and a histogram in the bottom. So if you have an assistant camera operator to the side, you can give them various things that will be able to help them do their job because it's set up for that in that direction. 502 and of course the Sidefinder combination both have uh, HDMI and SDI in and out, and they cross convert. So you can go in HDMI, out SDI, or vice versa. Uh, and of course, just regular pass through as well. And it has a negative two to plus four diopter, which is quite wide. So anybody with uh, vision troubles will have no problem. The battery life is quite good. You'll uh, LPE6 mount, so it's a Canon 5D battery. And uh, just one of those will power it for two hours. So if you stack two, you get four. If you have a power tap sort of lead cable that comes from a DTAP battery and it's meant to power uh, like a Canon camera, it'll also power this just fine too. And, and uh, this is the remote that ships with the Sidefinder, and this allows you to use the entire monitor uh, without having to, you know, finagle your finger into the, you know, into the normal uh, operation. And this will actually click into the back of the monitor right here, and it will actually be able to, to flip up, uh, sort of like a, like a mailbox. And, uh, that just allows you to be as versatile as possible, and you can clip that off, put it in your pocket, operate the monitor. For example, if you're on a steady cam and you can't bump the monitor at all, but you still want to change features, you can just keep the remote in your pocket, and it will uh, allow you to, uh, to do that.